The channels are used by locals as waterways. Floating along these channels, you experience a totally new view of life. It's not unusual to find yourself in a traffic jam at rush hour. But it's all very leisurely and relaxed, and there's always a helping hand should your boat get stuck. There's an abundance of waterfowl about, and you may even see an occasional fish jump out of the water. Sunsets here are especially picturesque. Coastal wetlands are home to a large variety of birds. Permanent residents such as crows, eagles, hawks, kites, sparrows, miners, etc. can be seen all the time. But there are also a number of migratory birds. The salt and freshwater mix support a range of plants specialized to survive in salty environments. Fish, shrimp, crab and other creatures find food, shelter and oxygen in the waters beneath the tree roots. Perhaps the most important role of mangroves is that they provide a spawning ground for the fish and shrimp. Another important function of the mangroves is holding back the seas. They serve not only as a natural barrier to saltwater intrusion, but also keep the shores safe from waves and high tides, particularly in stormy seasons. This is especially important for populated areas. The villagers come to the mangroves for three reasons. To fish, to catch mud crabs, and to cut wood for fuel and building material. The wood is piled up on boats and taken back to the villages for drying and usage. The mangrove belt stretches across the entire Pakistani coast and is the thickest in the Indus Delta. With a thick canopy and an undergrowth of saplings, they are home to small marine life, a source of food and spawning. And they are an important natural barrier to seawater intrusion. 